Hi guys, Rachel Cook, Doctor of Audiology at Applied Hearing Solutions in Phoenix, Arizona. And in this video, I'm gonna be showing you how to use your iPhone to turn into a spy. Coming up. If you have an iPhone, then you know that Apple is constantly releasing cool, integrated features. For example, Apple Pay lets its users add credit or debit cards to a virtual wallet allowing you to use your watch or phone to simply tap and pay. They also added Face ID technology, allowing you to unlock your phone or auto-complete your passwords just by looking at the screen. But Apple has raised the bar on audio features as well, with the addition of a new feature called Live Listen. This feature has the ability to turn anyone with AirPods or made-for-iPhone hearing aids into a spy. But before I tell you just how it's done, please take a moment to give this video a thumbs up to bring videos like these to a wider audience. And while you're at it, if you haven't already, make sure you hit that subscribe button with notification bell so that you never miss any one of our newly released videos. I really appreciate it. Now let's dive into how you can use your iPhone to spy on your friends, family, or even your pets using AirPods or hearing aids. I'd like to start off with a disclaimer that this video is just for fun and to teach you more about how to use your own devices. So make sure that you use this tip for good. Now, Apple first pioneered audio features specific for AirPods and made for iPhone hearing aids in 2014. This included wireless Bluetooth streaming as well as integrated remote controls for your devices using the Control Center mini menu shortcut. Apple then released the first generation of AirPods in 2016, the AirPods 2 and AirPods Pro in 2019, AirPods Max in 2020, the AirPods 3 in 2021, and the most recent edition of AirPods Pro 2 in September of 2022. There's also the upcoming launch of AirPods Max 2 in 2023. With these Apple earbuds and headphones, came proprietary integrated audio features that were then expanded to made for iPhone or MFI hearing aids. In 2018, the Live Listen feature was released allowing your iPhone to turn into a remote microphone, sending the sound directly into your AirPods or made for iPhone hearing aids simply with the tap of a button. This is very similar to the way that phone calls or media can be streamed into AirPods or hearing aids with the exception that this can be done at any time without the need for an active phone call. This means that you could turn Live Listen on, walk into a room full of people, set your iPhone down, leave the room, and still hear everything that people are saying without them even knowing, just like a spy would do. I first learned of this feature from a patient who turned it on not knowing what it was and then left the room without his cell phone. His wife walked into the room that he was in and began speaking to their cat. And although he was in the other room, he could hear her speaking to their cat clear as day. He thought he was going crazy, but once he realized what Live Listen does, this unintentional discovery turned out to be pretty useful. While this feature can allow you to spy on your spouse and your cat, just in case they're plotting against you, this feature also provides some pretty helpful assistance for those with hearing difficulties. For example, many people with hearing loss report that front seat passengers in the car are difficult to hear if they are seated in the back seat of the car. This can be the result of distance, road noise, and the fact that their voice is projecting forward. With Live Listen, handing the phone up to the front seat can help to reduce the distance and clean up the sound before sending that speech right into your devices. This is also great to consider for use in less than ideal listening situations, such as classrooms or churches, across long tables during dinner or a meeting, and can even be used next to a TV speaker for a stronger, clearer sound. To try out Live Listen yourself, you must have an iPhone and AirPods or made for iPhone hearing aids. If you have AirPods, you'll begin by pairing these in the Bluetooth menu on your iPhone. If you have made for iPhone hearing aids, you will need to go into your accessibility settings, then to hearing devices, and pair up your hearing aids there first. Next, head over to the control center settings 
and be sure to enable the hearing shortcut, allowing you quick access to these controls at any time. The way you access your control center hearing shortcut depends on the model of your iPhone. For iPhones with the home button, you can access the control center by swiping up. For iPhones without a home button, this menu is accessed by swiping down from the top right corner. In this menu, you will see various controls for your hearing aids or AirPods, but you are looking for the microphone icon labeled Live Listen. Once enabled, the icon will turn blue and the phone will begin to collect sound from the microphone and wirelessly transmits that sound into both hearing aids or headphones. The transmission range is dependent on many variables, but for the most part averages around 30 feet. The sound quality and volume is dependent on the distance between the source and the microphone. The closer to the microphone, the clearer the sound quality. It's also important to note that not all hearing aids are made for iPhone hearing aids. MFI devices include Bluetooth-enabled hearing aid models from Oticon, Resound, Signia, Starkey, and Widex. Unfortunately, Phonak and Unitron hearing aids utilize a different type of Bluetooth streaming, and therefore this feature will not be available for those brands. However, this feature is fully compatible with all of the Apple AirPod models. Overall, how you choose to use the Live Listen feature is up to you, but it does provide some quick and easy relief to those users with hearing loss in tricky listening situations. Care to share how you use the Live Listen feature? Definitely let us know in the comment section below. That's it for this video. If you liked it, be sure to give it a thumbs up and share it with someone that you think could use it. And if you haven't done so, be sure to subscribe to our channel so that you never miss any one of our newly released videos. Oh,